should be enough to get you to Gotham. Thank you. I hope you find what you're looking for. Bus station's just about a mile up. Do we have access? Yes. You come out of Stonegate, and you're acting like you still own what you did before you went in. You don't. My heart family has taken over the north. The Kozlov's the east, the Thorns the south, the Riddler. West. No, fortune is set to be Thorns' man at Kittredge Park, the Huntress is disrupting all of our affairs. From what I hear, she just shut down Black Mass's activities. Nightwing has entered the fray, and you're asking me if I'm interested in expanding to your network? I can still get you the best Eden Spring in town, Ray. <laughs> well, best Eden Spring. <laughs> what a joke. Isley's Kiss and Thornhill's Treasure are all over Gotham now. Well, even Giordano's got his own brand. Magic Kiss. Because loves, they have Red Kiss. You're behind on the times, Jane. My connections are still very strong. Dominique Alioso did not take them with her when she caught the next flight out of Gotham. Jane, Dominique sold us most of her connections before she left. She didn't want you to know that, having threatened her and all. You understand. Oh, well, Jane, Miss Candace. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> Please tell Telly and Giordano to give them our best regards and we'll see them at the next meeting. Look, Candace, I'm sorry. A Sculpty. You are nothing more than a dog to us. What happened in there was disgraceful and a shame to the Thorn Familia. Candace, it was Dominique's fault. Dominique Alioso is who knows where. Later today, you'll be riding with Alessia and Jocko. If you mess things up with her, you'll be answering to Rotelli. Not me. He won't be as forgiving. We have a lot riding on you. Don't make us regret freeing you. God may. Drive us back to Kalesa's, Jocko. You look nice without makeup, and you have too much caked on, you look like a male Gaisha or something. I am wearing makeup. You still look nice. You should be less concerned with how I look and more concerned with getting your thumb dry. This is a simple snatch and grab, what's the fuss about? That's me to know, and you don't. Secrets, I, I thought we were past that. That was then, this is now. We need to forget about what we had and focus on what we don't. Here to the happy couple. The couple. <laughs> Cheers. Right, guys. Cheers. It's a long life and prosper and all that good stuff. I like it, thought you were yeah, you like um, a little something that you might so enjoy. So you knew it was going to happen. It's a good memory. Well, yeah. you know, we thought it would. Okay. And, you we know, had our suspicions. Do you, do you want to open this? this? Okay, yeah. Now, don't use it all at once now. <laughs> no. That would have been, I mean, come on, at the end of this day. Down, you almost no. smelled magic. <laughs> Hold on a second. I had to go take this. It's low, okay? Right back. Hello. So, I mean, so, yeah. it's pretty sweet you're engaged, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 
was. I mean, he asked me before, but I said no. I know. He was persistent. <laughs> Sure, I haven't like talked to him about it, but how long have you known this? I don't know for a couple weeks. I, I didn't know what to a say. A couple weeks? Why didn't you tell me? Because I didn't know if it was true, you know. And now he, well, now it seems like it's true, and I want to tell you. He just proposed to her. No, it's fucked up. And I don't think she has any suspicion. Suspicion. I, well, I don't, like what it. I don't understand is why you didn't tell me about it. I, you know, I hate walking into I, situations where I don't I have all the information. Sure. I, don't, I wasn't sure if it was true. And of course, like, I don't want to say you, something if it's but not. You still didn't tell me. Who the hell is this? Someone who knows what you want and how you can get it. You may have heard of me. Oracle. Why am I not surprised? Yeah, I've heard a lot about you. Well, well. Here I thought it was just gonna be us boys. And so did I. Batman works alone. The rest of us have teams. Yeah, I know a few things about teams, Oracle. I know you do. Hunter's told us about your team up. Excuse me, can we can the lover's quarrel for a minute and get to work? She's not. <laughs> Good evening, gentlemen. Oh, is this a private meeting or can any vigilante join? Jim, how did you get to... Really, Strife? I don't give away the commissioner's title just to anyone. You have to earn it. From the ground up. Well, this is awkward. Why is it awkward? Who's there? Commissioner. It's an honor to finally meet you. I'm Nightwing. Some of us heroes like a proper introduction. Who's the girl on the phone? Commissioner Gordon. I'm Oracle. I'm a friend of Batman's. I've heard of you. Uh, I thought you were a myth. And you should update your files with no longer Commissioner. It may not seem like much, but I still believe in you. If I were Commissioner, maybe I'd get an invite to one of these secret rooftop meetings every once in a while. I wasn't aware that Gotham PD cared about helping anyone. It was because of cops like you that... Clandestine meetings, withholding information from other officers. No wonder they think we need a Batman to do our job. Oh yeah, and people like him, they've been doing a marvelous job at that. Okay, can we turn down the testosterone and talk like adults? Nightwing! Enough! Jane Kulesa's still out there. Which means we have work to do. Jane Michael Kulesa was released from Stonegate Penitentiary 24 hours ago. She was cleared by a doctor, Azanara, the psychologist who replaced Dr. O'Brien. Azanara is tied to the Thorn family. Not surprising that Kulesa got fast transfer with the system. Earlier today, she had several meetings with other mob families across town. Tonight, however, she's being handed off some significant hardware by the last Falcone herself. What kind of hardware, Oracle? A, a thumb drive. Uh, it's got all information about drug rings in Gotham. Could go all the way up to our boss. We get that drive, and we get one step closer to putting Kalesa behind bars. And with that drive, it's an open and shut case. If we're up to me, I'd end this right now with a bolt between her eyes. Do something like that, and we're gonna have a conversation where you wind up in jail, my friend. Clock's ticking, gentlemen. I'll grab the drive. Jim, I'm gonna need you to run back up. Got it. You feel comfortable doing this on your own, son, huh? I'll be fine. Good luck. I'm sending you the coordinates, Nightwing. Commissioner Gordon, Detective Strife. Thank you again. Why not let him go or something? Yeah. It's not our place to really say anything. Right? Mm -hmm. Strife. Yes. is not going to get away with it this time. I've heard that before. Nightwing, you. It won't make any difference. If you really feel that way, then what are you doing on this roof? Come on. I'll give you a ride home. Alrighty, it's time to get 
serious. I have one, two, three, four heat signatures approaching the apartment. Uh, two in the front door, the other two, I don't know. You know, at one point, I actually respected you, Jane. Using poison ivy, killing cops, forcing Dominique Galeoso out of Gotham. God, she was pathetic. But times have changed. You need to adapt. What's this? Homework. Contacts of the people involved in Fortune's drug running. People you will start out working with. Do well? You move up into the next group. Ladies. Who are you? Oh, don't act like you don't know Janie. Kids call me Nightwing. I know you don't know that because you've been away for a while. But it's okay. But look at who you have with you. Alessia Falcone. The last Falcone. It's nice to see that you're... Uh, Looked up from your upstanding family business. To start babysitting for mom. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. You've been causing us a lot of problems as of late. That will end tonight. I do know you. Batman's little errand boy. How cute. You really think I'm cute? I don't know what you freaks in masks do, but I can't let you leave. Good, because I thought you were going to run out on me. Oh, honey back on Loeb's force. That special task force that kind of wants masks like you did. Meet Jack and Carlos, two new friends of mine, disgruntled former cops. We went in and fixed them up good. Now there's not much going on upstairs, but what a staircase. Say hi, Jack and Carlos. You know I don't speak fluent Italian. You know this, Jacques. Listen, we've got the squad coming.
we're half a mile out from Nightwing's location. Those orders are to take them in. Grayson, sometimes you're so irresponsible. Why the hell aren't you answering? Code red. Repeat, code red. Next time on Nightwing Escalation. I don't mean to intrude, but I heard what happened.